All right, I thought I'd capture this for you today. Again, out on the six Chevy Silverado here. Um, now I have replaced the uh, cylinders, the wheel cylinders here. And what I'm going to do is need to in, uh, bleed the brakes again because this has introduced air into the system. So if you have something like a Mighty Vac, what you can do is test it and make sure first that you have no leaks that will pump up with pressure. And you can do that just with your hand and it'll hold the pressure. Okay, now, so now what we're going to do is I'm going to open the bleeder valve on the cylinder and I'm going to pull fluid through the system and I'm going to take all the air out of the system and when I see a solid stream, I'll know the air is out of the system. Now, in doing this, you'll also need to keep your reservoir up front full. And then the Chevy Silverado uses dot three fluid, so so it's got plenty of fluid up front. So the next procedure now is to put this on the bleeder valve, pump it up, get some pressure going, open that, and let it pull some of that fluid out. <laughs> 